Hey everyone, hope all is well. My name is Miles Dyer and this is my speaker box for the 401 show. Does social media have a dark side? Well, it certainly does with Darth Vader alone having over 300,000 likes on Facebook. But joking aside, do social media sites provide a nice happy environment for us all to interact in? Well, yes, for the most part. I'd argue that the pros outweigh the cons by a long shot, but only if we use the platform responsibly. There are lots of great reasons for using social media. It connects you with your friends and family. It connects you with the world. It allows you to share and discuss ideas. You can collate media about yourself, like photos and videos. It's fun. It can allow you to become more sociable, and it can keep you informed with current events. But there can be a darker side to social media. Social norms can be distorted. People may use it as an opportunity to brag constantly. It may perpetuate the fear of missing out on things. You may be forced to start considering the public you. What is your brand? What is your persona? Things like sexting, hate speech, miscommunication, and dealing with the fact that comments and pictures you post can be seen by multiple people. However, I believe that the dark side of social media can only manifest manifest itself when we give it the opportunity to. And so I've got some quick tips that should help minimalize bad experiences on social media. Number one, don't post personal information online. This includes addresses, phone numbers, anything you wouldn't want a stranger to know about you. Number two, only have people you truly trust in your close contact circles. For example, friends on Facebook. Number three, only post things about people you know online if you know they wouldn't mind. So this includes photos of them, or if you're writing a status that includes their name, just be mindful. And number four, don't let the posts of others get to you. Now I know that's easier said than done, whether people are boasting or criticizing out loud, just have some inner strength. Take it in that way, look at it and say, well, what do I like about what they've done? What could I do to enrich my life? What do I want to get out of it? And you'll be much happier. Like with most things in life, it's all about learning from our own experiences and sharing them with other people so they don't make the same mistakes. So tell me, what bad experiences have you had with social media and how did you overcome them? Or perhaps it's a problem that's ongoing. Let us know in the comments below. We'd love to hear your thoughts and discuss amongst yourselves. And so by learning off each other, we can collectively have a happier and healthier experience with social media on a day-to-day -day basis, hopefully staying away from that darker side. Be sure to subscribe to The 401 Show to see mine and your opinions get discussed with a whole bunch of other people on March 26th. So thanks for watching and adios till next time.